Hey guys, I'm back again, and I am doing a video for, uh, Instructables. A lot of what I'm saying, I went over more in depth in Instructables post, so hopefully I'll remember to link that in. But today, we're going to be using Port Hack. Now, what Port Hack is, is it's a way on, like, if it runs on a Telnet server, uh, it can view ports of another server, and you can add yourself as an account if you have an account on the server you're using it from. Now, Chrome OS there isn't exactly a terminal. Like, if you do Control T, you can open a web browser in a terminal tab with, you, with very few commands. SSH is... So we're going to try SSH... Not SSH. SSH root app. Tellyhack.com. Yeah. Connection refuse. Like I said in the clears not a command. Like I said in the uh, instructable. Not all sites will support SSHing into it, so we can do SSH root at 1984.ws. Now, whatever you type in for the root password is right. Watch them hit one and enter. No one's password is just one. Now it's going to take a minute. And we load the thing. And that's it. So we're going to do control Q, control C. Neither does work, okay. Leave the page, yes. Now, while we're in the port hack interface, what we did was we did, uh, what you call it? We, we went to telehack.com. You can access this one in a browser. Uh, sorry about that noise. There's a plane going overhead. I'm outside, and I live near an airport. Give it a second, it'll pass. Again, okay, now that we're in the web interface, in the plane pass, we can do, once you log in, you need to log in, you're going to do, uh, you know, do ls, and you if you see port hacker, you can use port hacker. Then you just type port hacker to run port hacker. Easy enough. Then you do the captcha, which, like, see how at the top of the screen I have 9554. That that was the captcha I had. Now, you can do, this isn't all the hosts, there's a lot of them. Now we're doing TNSTFL, don't know who that is. Uh, so, now we're in, we have a whole bunch of ports to try. FTP, Telnet, Finger, Chipman, ET minus NDP, Z39, T. TOS, Ominox, OC underscore S, and login. Now, the easiest thing to do is just type 21, and then 23, and 77 to 23. You're going to have to do trial and error. Now, we'll do 79. Okay, 79 to so 163. And it worked. We're adding my account to the thing. Now we're going to do tel, telnet, t, what's the server name? T, n, s, n, s, t, f, l. Authorized users only. Uh, oh, God. So, I will not be logging into that. Because that would be breaking the law. But it added me, and... I did give this disclaimer, so let me get in trouble for this, not you guys, but... Since I didn't log in, I didn't technically access it. So, um... I'm um, technically fine. Now, I'm in it. I've been added to the accounts and stuff, but 
I made this account just for that, and I will be getting offline with that now. So now that we have that, we uh, just learn how to hack using Telnet. And I've seen a lot of instructables out there, like hack using Telnet or command line, and it's just some random useless script that does nothing or like delete system 32 or something. But this actually works, and I'll link that in the description. So see you guys next time, and thanks for watching.